and police have leads in one of the murders that have a lot of people worried. Detectives in Santa Fe have just told us in the last few minutes they have now interviewed a man they've been looking for, a man named Sam Leva. He, they believe, is involved with the Santa Fe's latest murder, and News 13 Scott Daniels is going to tell us the latest now from Santa Fe. Yeah, guys, right in the neighborhood where the murder happened, police searched all day, and that led them to 51-year-old Sam Leva, who just turned himself in. Santa Fe police say Leva is directly involved of the killing of 53-year-old David Martinez. Martinez has a long rap sheet. He has been arrested in crimes from New York to Arizona. Martinez and Leba lived near each other off West Alameda Street where the body was found. Police spent today searching inside Leba's home. Santa Fe police said they found evidence outside of Leba's house that linked him to the murder. They believe Martinez was murdered in one location and his body dumped in the park nearby. Investigators think they have the murder weapon but will not say what it is or where they found it. This is the same neighborhood where a business owner was murdered in his home last month. Police think Ethan Boyer was killed by a burglar. Investigators are looking into the possibility that the two murders are connected. They say this neighborhood has seen its fair share of trouble. Individuals that we spoke with uh, during the canvases explained that they did hear sounds that were similar to gunshots. That being said, they also advised that they barely regularly hear gunshots in that particular area. Because of the murders and the rash of crime in that area, two city councilors and the police chief are, holy, are hosting a community meeting at this Saturday at noon at the Mary Esther Gonzalez Senior Center. Back to you. All right. Thank you, Scott. Police say others could be involved in Martinez's murder.